We're here with Megan, our CRM expert. We've talked about what is CRM and how small businesses use CRM. Now we're going to talk about a house, how a small business can get started with a CRM. So if someone wants to get started with a CRM, they're going to want to import their contact list that they have. In order to do that, they need to prepare it in a CSV. Okay. They'll have their data in a CSV file, first name, last name, email, phone number, any other fields that they want to house within their CRM. Okay. They're going to import that CSV mm -hmm. and they're going to appropriately field map their current fields within the CRM to the contact record fields so that okay. we can have everything move accordingly so it's very easy when they go ahead and open their CRM that they know exactly where all the information is being housed. Excellent. So a CRM information system seems like it's got, um, could get kind of big and scary. Is it, uh, like how much do you have to know ahead of time before you start importing? Great question. I would say definitely start small with your list if you want to get comfortable with importing your data. A lot of the times small business owners will start with the basic information. Yeah. Um, if they do feel more comfortable with getting data into their CRM, they'll go ahead and add custom fields, which okay. essentially is just fancy way of saying fields that don't exist in the CRM that's custom to your business. Okay. Um, and they might even go ahead and segment their list as well, and there's ways to segment that. We can talk a little bit further at another time. But obviously the more you add, the more complex it gets. So start off small and work your way up. Excellent, well that sounds great. So here we are, we just talked about how you can get started. We actually have a little bit more to talk about in, in the related article, so check out the link in the description to see how it works. If you wanna see more videos like this one to help your business, um, please subscribe to the channel. Um, and then uh, we'll see you next time.